do here so I'm um, gonna be going over um so this video I'm gonna be going over the half of the weapons I um, use and the half of the weapons I don't use so um basically it's gonna be like a half I'm doing the other half for this video and I'm gonna do the half for the other video on a later date and so uh hope you guys do enjoy let me know what classes you want me to try because I almost got mostly every gun. Still got to get the Stingray. I think I got every SMG in this game. And um, still got to get that uh, the Echo Hawk. I don't know what that thing is called, but uh, yeah, I think I basically almost got every weapon in the game. Uh, snipers, I kind of really. So let's get this started, shall we? First off, the ICR seven. Now I kind of rarely touch this gun because um. I'm not really like you know a fan of this gun. I like that Black Ops 3 ICR because uh, it hits better. And sometimes since the since the game has bullet travel, I hope you don't put that bullet travel in the next Call of Duty. I don't want bullet travel. It's kind of hard sometimes to hit your shots with this, but it's really good for long range. But I don't not I do not recommend using this for uh, close range. And so though, yeah, that's all I have to say about this gun. Rampart. I mean, uh, I this I did win some couple of gunfights in close range, so I guess this can be viable. Um, a pretty high damage weapon. This actually one is one of the annoying weapons I hate to die by too. Like yeah, I can actually eliminate eliminate you in a two or three shot kill, with high 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 two high calibers. And so, um, I kind of touch this gun times to times, but it's basically is a camper's gun sometimes so uh yeah that's all I have to say about the rampart KM57 uh, this is actually a good teams gun or free for all but I kind of don't really use the KM57 free for all so I just like use this for uh, teams and um you already know what's up I sometimes I run this in team death deathmatch and um this is a really good gun I highly recommend using and uh, if you get all the attachments, you can do work with this. If is that if you play Nuketown, you don't get sweat on. <laughs> the Vapor XKG, uh, I kind of I kind of like touch this a lot. So um, Vapor is, is a pretty good weapon, close range and long range. So uh, this is a pretty good weapon to use too. <gasps> Try hard's gun. Sometimes I. Sometimes the, this gun doesn't have a lot of aim assist, so I, I don't know how people use it, but I gotta use it more. But, uh, yeah. SWAT, I mean, I touch this sometimes to times too. It's basically like the ICR, but it's the better version. And I love to use this gun a lot. Basically, another long range weapon. And, uh, yeah. The glue, which is called the graph, all we, I, I touch this a lot with that thermal. Slap on that thermal, quick draw, stock, um, with um, extended mags. Because since this gun doesn't have extended mags, I mean fast mags, extended mags is your best choice. I, I always like to run thermal on this. And um, yeah, this is a pretty good gun to use. Peacekeeper, this is the best assault rifle in the game. And so I... Uh, Sometimes I touch this and sometimes I don't. But this is a good gun too. Alright. Alright, so we're going to go over the SMG. Alright, so uh, the MX-9. I kind of really touch this gun. I kind of like basically stay away from this gun. It's not that really, you know, competitive. GKS, I use this, I use this sometimes to times. It's actually a pretty good gun, but it's a little bit weak. But you can, ma you can manage it with high mobility and everything. This is a good gun to use. Spitfire, I mean, this is a good gun to use too. I must sometimes I just use this in new town or just like in some matches, but sometimes I gotta really touch this. Cordate, mm, I don't, I gotta start using this again. And this is a good gun, a lot of ammo. Um, operator my is it's an infinite ammo, so uh, but basically 600 rounds, but you don't have to reload. Sometimes I just touch this gun times to times, or I just pick it up. But I don't really run this in my class. So I'm gonna try to do that. Sogs, Sog. 
this is a good gun I always run this for competitive when pushing hard 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 I, I, I basically use this to replace the VMP because I'm just tired of using that gun it's broken Alright, we're going with the DEMON! You already know what time it is! This is my baby when I started my YouTube channel! Woo! Man, I used to rock this every single time in my old account. You know how this is. This honestly could be better than that VMP. I mean... High Caliber 2 Rapid Fire? This thing would do some work. I always, used, I always like to run Steady Grip. That actually reduce your hip fire. But I thought it controls your recoil, and to be honest, this thing doesn't really have any recoil. To be honest, actually, none of these guns don't really have recoil, but a little bit bouncy recoil, just like the Hades. <gasps> the Hades and the Augur. But, uh, you know what time it is. You already know what Damon it is. My baby Damon, Mark II, too? <laughs> Alright. Ah, my favorite gun of all time. That's when my YouTube started right here. The Damon Mark II. Switchblade. I mean, I touched. I mean, I just got this. So, uh, this is a good uh, gun. Basically, uh, just another version of the Sogs, but uh, I think it has basically the same thing, similar stats. So it says I had higher damage, but I feel like this thing can be a little bit weak. So, uh, yeah. VMP, I mean, you guys already know how broken this is. I mean, I touch this times to times to, you know, warm up my game, and then I just switch up to another gun sometimes. But uh, this is a really broken gun. You guys got to come back and nerf it. That's no joke. Legit brokenness. And this is honestly one of the boring guns to use every single time I, like, go competitive. I just want to use something different. But, yeah, VMP is a good gun. Broken. Just give it a try. But don't use it all the time. Cause it's gonna get boring. Micro MG nine millimeter. This is basically my camper's guns. I mean, I, 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 this is not a rare gun to, for me to use. I, I always use this every single time I like play some like campy or like maps that I want to camp in. So basically, this is basically this is a trolling gun. And uh, yeah. Guess this is it's all the SMGs. Let's get it. All right, moving into tactical rifles, which basically is a team base guns right here. So the auger, a pretty annoying weapon to die by too. A two shot kill with high caliber too. But if you don't high caliber, this is always a three shot kill. It's a two shot in the head, I think, with a high caliber or high caliber. I don't know, but uh, this is annoying to die by too. I mean, I. I touch this sometimes at times with a little bit wonky recoil and accuracy. Can gotta get you sometimes. ABR, a standard three burst rifle. Basically just like a another version of the M16, like a AUG type vibe. But uh I mean I touch this times to times too. But a little bit of the sway can get you. A lot of these tactical rifles have a lot lot of lot of sway. Like it like has a little bit of high low low aim assist that's that's what i was trying to say low aim assist and then short fish i kind of really touched this i mean i never really use this gun every single time i prestige i just like ignored this ignore this gun i mean i gotta get i gotta use this a little bit more see how really good it is so i don't really have words for this then m16 i mean it's a throwback rifle i mean i touched this basically the same as the ebr Low emesis, a good. They are just they. These are the good tactical rifles, basically team deathmatch. But I don't really recommend using these for free for all. But if you do, I just highly recommend that you camp with it because you can't really push up with these rifles. Well, ABR sometimes you can, but with the M16, sword, swordfish, and auger, I don't really recommend it. So that's all for the tactical rifles. Now we're going into the sniper rifles. Now this is going to be extremely rare in this. So now we got the power the HB50. Now this is a, this is actually my um, most used bow action sniper rifle. It's like another version of the Barrett 50 cal. But um, I use this to snipe and just snipe my competitive sniping. 
So I basically go to bow action sniper playlist and just use this. Or sometimes I just use this in free fall, but not recommend sniper free fall. <laughs> Outlaw, I mean, this is actually one of my other competitive weapons too, but uh, I guess a lot of hit markers. So uh, this is a really fast bow action sniper rifle, as you see. Outlaw, bow action sniper rifle, fast free chamber with improved mobility. So basically, this is like a pretty competitive one too. I use this a lot, so well, not a lot, like times to times. <gasps> SDM basically a camper's gun too. Basically, I just use this to nuke down, or like I find some like camping spot and just use this for like camping. I don't really recommend pushing pushing up with this because um they don't have good uh, hip fire accuracy. And the and only problem is that there's actually three semi-autos in this game. And they cannot be in the bow action sniper rifles list because it's bow action. Keyword bow, bow action. Koshka, I mean, I touched this from times to times, but this thing does get a lot of hit markers too. Basically the same as the outlaw, but uh slow mo mobility and faster handling. Like it even says right there. Um, just a quick bow action, a quick handling gun. I mean, this could be used for competitors too, but I just basically use the pattern or the outlaw. I don't really touch the Casca. I still gotta really use this because a uh, high count without high count of this thing is kind of useless. The Vendetta, same thing as the SDM. I'm not gonna really go over it. I did make a video of it. This now this has some great hip fire accuracy too, but it's it's always a three shot kill and it's always a one shot in the head. Now I wanna. I want to explain something. How come the SDM is a two shot, but it's not a one shot to the head? I don't know. I literally don't know. But you put on high caliber, it makes it one shot. So, uh, and this gun doesn't have high caliber, so. Have Lena. Now, um, I kind of touch this sometimes. Since this, this is down to the snipers list. Gotta, like, really work with my, um thing here so I kind of touch this basically the same thing as the paladin I kind of use this aggressively but uh, you can just spam 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 it and uh, I think that's it I don't have other words to say so that's all for the primary list I think we're gonna go over the secondaries in the next half of the video I made it to the end I really appreciate you guys and uh, if you guys want to see more stuff like this leave a like subscribe if you're new and uh, yeah and I'll uh, follow my twitch I actually started, I'm going to be starting the Twitch channel. And I may actually stream tonight, depending what my internet is like. Because my internet's not that great sometimes. So, uh, yeah. Uh, but yeah, thank you, for, thank you for watching. And uh, the next half will be coming pretty soon. And uh, yeah. Stay tuned. Stay safe. Wash your hands. Stay positivity. And uh, yeah. I'll uh, see you guys later. And stay home with your mask. You don't want to keep saying that.